design push down automata for the following language l is equal to 0 power 2n <coughs> 1 power n such that n is greater than 0 the string pattern in the language is defined as the number of zeros is twice the number of ones so for example let us consider the string there are six zeros which is followed by three ones we know that the string belongs to the language I have just given the block diagram of PDA that is an input tape in the input tape we have stored the string we know that the control unit reads the string character by character from left to right and there is a stack the stack is empty to indicate the emptiness of the stack there is always Z0 at the bottom of the stack so the control unit starts reading the zeros the logic goes like this whenever it reads the odd number of zeros there is no operation on the stack whenever it reads the even number of zeros the one symbol gets pushed down to the stack the one symbol what we are going to push is one itself when it reads the first zero no operation on the stack when it reads the second zero one gets pushed onto the stack when it reads the third zero no operation on the stack when it reads the fourth zero that is the even number of zero one gets pushed onto the stack when it reads the fifth zero no operation when it reads the sixth zero one gets pushed onto the stack now PDA finished reading all the zeros now at this moment it continue to read the ones once it starts reading the one it will be compared with the top of the stack if there is one on the top of the stack that one will be removed from the stack so when it reads this one there is a one so this one is removed when it reads the next one the another one is also removed it goes like this at one point it reaches the end of the string that time we expect our stack should be empty so keeping this logic in mind let us write the transition rules before that we discuss the format of the transition rule the transition rule goes like this k is the state sigma is the input alphabet this symbol indicates the top of the stack so from the given state on reading the symbol from the input tape it checks what is available at the top of the stack this is a current configuration of the PDA if this is the current configuration this indicates the consequence what the action has to be taken by the PDA the state may be changed to some other state by pushing or popping the contents onto the stack so the logic is being uh, just discussed as a glimpse in the form of a transition diagram from the state Q0 it reads the first zero nothing to do with the stack on reading the second zero push one onto the stack on reading the third zero it goes to q1 no operation on the stack on reading the fourth zero it comes back to q0 now we are pushing one more one onto the stack so between q0 and q1 it keeps switching for even number of zeros after reading even number of zeros from the state q0 it happens for the PDA to read 1 when it reads 1 we change the state to Q2 so this is the logic for the change of states keeping all these things in mind let us write the transition rules now the transition rules goes like this the first column is the current state of the PDA the second column is the input alphabet the third column indicates the top of this track the fourth and the fifth column together is nothing but the change of the state and what is the change in the contents of this track so let me draw a line here like this the first transition rule q0 is the start state from the start state we expect the PDA to read the very first zero we are expecting the PDA to read zeros first followed by ones later so when it reads the first zero obviously stack is empty the state is changed to q1 no operation on the stack now the current state of pda is q1 because we changed the state to q1 from q1 it reads the second zero when it reads the second zero the stack is empty as of now but whenever it reads the even number of zeros we have to push one so one is pushed down to the stack now from the state q0 it reads the third zero when it reads the third zero top of the stack contains one 
Now the state is flipped or changed to Q1. Top of the stack is 1 as of now. No operation on the stack. Now from Q1, again it is reading the fourth zero. The state is changed to Q0. Top of the stack is 1. Above the top of the stack, we are pushing 1. The point to be noted is whenever it reads the even number of zeros from the state Q1, the state is changed to Q0. That time we are pushing 1. And these two transition rules work recursively. This will read the fifth zero, no operation on this track, but the state is changed to Q1. Again, it may <coughs> read the sixth zero, the state is changed to Q0. It will push 1. It continues like this for all the zeros. At one point, after consuming all the zeros, push down automata reads. 1 from the state Q0. When it reads once, the top of the stack contains once. That time, change the state to Q2 and we are writing epsilon. This epsilon indicates whatever is available at the top of the stack is to be removed. So, 1 is removed from the top of the stack. Now, the current state of PDA is Q2. From Q2, it continues to read the rest of the 1. Whenever it reads 1, the expected symbol at the top of this track is 1. That time it continues to stay in Q2 every time popping 1 from the track. After some point from the state Q2, it reached the end of the string. When it reaches the end of the string, we are expecting the stack to be empty. That time the state is changed to Q3 and we announce Q3 is the accepting state. Thank you.